Oh, Doctor, this is this space we're in. It's something like a rift. What's that supposed to mean? Rift like, but not a rift. It's riffish. Feels like a rift that's been given a kind of directionality, but it will require going deeper to say for sure, analysis wise. When you say given, do you mean it's done intentionally? With Oma and Shadow Lord involved, that's almost a certainty. Good point. Bison didn't think twice before leaping in here, after all. Is this thing, is this Iron Bird thing you're going to be able to catch up to him? Looks like we're already being dumped back into a normal space, though I couldn't tell. I couldn't tell you if Bison came along this way, too. Let's find a spot first, landing wise. Don't forget to scan the atmosphere, Doctor. I don't want to get caught out and discover there's no air. Well, aren't we picky? Fine, fine. Only the most breathable auction for Her Majesty. Perfect, another doom and gloom world. Where we wind up this time. Looks like a graveyard and a pretty old one at that. Looks like a completely deserted. Looks like it's been completely deserted. I doubt anyone's even made use of this place. And I, in a long time. By the way, you better, you're better than I thought. I've had a lot of practice. Why don't you? T why don't I take you on next? Cause I'm a Kiryu. Then we'll see just what you're made of. Oh dear, this can't be good. What are you doing? You mustn't fight one another. We're, we're talking about ping pong. You were playing ping pong. They've got arcade games and VR, arcade games and VR helmets too. Must be nice to work for the government. Does the agency know you're all hauling this stuff around, Doctor? Let's right, come quick. Now, so Hasuma, did you find something interesting? We're investigating these gravestones and we discovered a stairway under, leading underground. Of course, you always want to push the gravestones. You're bound to find a hidden staircase somewhere. Really, don't you think that's, uh, you know, disrespectful? Maybe this explains where Bison ran off to. Let's go check it out, Doctor. You stay here and make sure the Dragon Turtle is in good shape. Get us home. Good thing tools and of course oh and if you run across anything that looks valuable bring it back to me yourself okay are you saying are you a doctor or a retail empire oh, cosmos Mm, did I lose consciousness during the teleport? That's not supposed to. Who are you? Where am I and who are you? You don't look like a Hams. Are you a machine? It was Cosmos. I'm, an, I'm a combat android. ホームスじゃないのね。私はピオルン。ここは私みんなとメイナス神殿に通じる転送装置に入ったはずなのに。ここは寄進会のどのあたりなの？それとももしかして寄進会まで来ちゃったのかな？ここは惑星ミクタム
ピオルンあなたは異世界そんなコスモスどうやったら戻れるのこの場所は存在しないはずの場所長くとどまるべきではありません。急に雰囲気が変わっちゃったけどメイナスうんお願いしてもいいかなうん秩序に従属する者よホムスの魂を宿すあなたに問いますここは墓所あなたこの世界は過去の記憶から作り出されたもの多くを語る必要はありませんここはどこでもない場所なのですね For a day or two personalities sort of there's another one inside my body or something I don't quite get it myself she's very nice but I have to get back to our world so I can grant her wish If only I knew how to do that. What are those things you can see right through them? Gnosis, hostile enemies, and native to this world and time. They exist only in imaginary space. It is impossible to physically interact with them in real space. What you're saying is we can't touch them, is that correct? I do have my weaponry on me, but if we can't touch them, I guess it doesn't do much good. Restricting field that makes it possible to interfere with imaginary space. That this binds the gnosis from their alternate phase space to our normal space. So, in other words, we can touch them now. Is that correct? Works for me. Let's do this, Cosmos. Will you help me, Fiora? Of course. Besides, somehow it feels like we've met before. Like I've got some kind of bond with you, a human bond. Understood. Initiating battle. This place very relaxing. More now, what? More on Hobbs? Hey, there's someone back there. Monsters and two women. Looks like Gnosis. And there has to be Vector Cosmos. There has to be Vector's Cosmos. You know them? You'll be strider here, you in Rage's Zhao mood with you as well. We sure are. That's definitely Cosmos. You know her? Care to enlighten the rest of us? Lady Cyber 5 over there is Cosmos. Basically, an android. She fought with us last time. This sort of thing happened to us. Who's the other one? Is she a machine for him? She looks tougher than most chicks her size. That's for sure. Now for you, I'm afraid I'm not sure what I'm doing here. I just found myself here suddenly. Is she a robot too? Don't tell me, Cosmo's sister. If she just showed up here suddenly, maybe she's from another world, just like me. But Miss Ati, isn't this her? 
itself another world cosmos do you know where we are we are now i'm so sorry i'm like halfway asleep trying to read this stuff <laughs> this is renes le chateau renes le chateau a relic believed to be floating in the mitchton sector the planet mitchton that clinches it well well got something to tell us here you this is my time period from your perspective a timeline far into the future so from modern day shibuya we've crossed both time and space and time cosmos and gnosis alone would seem to be proof of that so those people all came from the past i have been involved in time travel incidents on several occasions it would appear that yet another one has commenced wait i just remembered you two haven't seen a man by the name of M. Bison, have you? You know if you had red military uniform, white white eyes, big muscles, butt chin that kills people. Nah, no thanks. Haven't encountered anyone. Except for Fiora and you. He's on a point. Can we count on you, Cosmos Fiora? You bet. Assuredly. Reggie and Xiao Mu. I see you've been caught up in yet another disturbance. Tell me about it, but hey, it's almost fun at this point. Shoulder. Chest I got. I don't they have one over here? Jimmy, <laughs> Come. 
picking on some of the spatial distortion. What's that? Something else is on this way here. Could be bison, but I'm assuming he, he got here before we did. That's unlikely. This distortion is almost identical to the one I saw when we discovered Fiora. Really? There must be someone else. Someone from my world. No wonder if they're Bionis or Mechanis. Uh, Pepper wants to teleport on the fridge or something. Uh, you know, kill a robot. Mm, my kind of metal face. Don't tell me Bison is piloting that thing. No, he's an enemy of ours from Mechanus. But Dunbun said they killed him. Well, she may have. Rather, Dunbun's little sister. Well, well, this is a surprise, I suppose. I have those golden chains to think. What are you doing here? Why are you still alive? So it's just the sister of the two. It's just the sister part who's conscious, is it? Splendid. You're just the one I need to kill to start my path of revenge. I'm afraid that's the part where you're wrong. Fiora and I are, are intertwined. We are still in the middle of our journey. Every fiber of our being is dedicated to the coming battle. But if you think you can kill us, you better think again. Long story, I'll fill you in later. Everyone get down to middle business. <laughs> I think I'll start with a little warm up. Here he comes. Oh god. I thought y'all just gonna start fighting. We're gonna say shop, oh my god, seriously? It's one of Bison's traps. Get us all distracted by bargains or something. It must be Dante. Only business trip for yours, this building of yours. I don't know, I've never seen it before at least. No, not here, just a regular physical movement. What do you mean? Come on, where could this be? Woman, who are you? Are you referring to me? I am Mirabella, this is my shop. What are you doing here? Thank goodness, try to hear you. What a pleasure surprise. One of our best customers. There's only so many places you can go for cyber parts. So she's with you, and she will no matter interfere with me and you'll see. I don't see that you regret it. I'm terribly sorry, I can assure you that I have nothing to worry about. But I am a simple merchant. I have no need to get involved in what is obviously a private quarrel. You know, can't you see we're in trouble here? If you don't just leave us, boy, the free market can be a brutal sometimes. Sorry, but I'm here strictly for business. I have a customer I'm escorting. Customer, you mean offer transportation services too? Hold on, can you, you can't take passengers through the battle zone like this. I'm afraid you misunderstand. This is my customer's destination. I'm sure this is the place. After all, I see Cosmos here. Or he said, this has something to do with me. There's everything to do with you. So this is where you've been hiding. This graveyard of all places. Machina, she looks like... Yeah, she T. Yellows. This is the perk. This is... More than perfect, I'll crush you again right in the same spot. And this time I'll harvest that spirit from inside of you. Okay, cool. I'll file you under Super Twisted. Mirabella, what's the meaning of this? Why are they helping her? This is Tielo. She's been a very loyal customer. And she says she would reward me handsomely if I were to deliver her to Miss Cosmo's whereabouts. And I take it you never asked why? Oh, I did. And she said she was going to kill Miss Cosmos. You knew when you brought her here anyway? I like her. That's right, Tiellos. This includes my services for this matter. Stay here until I kill him. I'll, I'll pay you for your time. Very well, Tiellos. I'll be waiting. Be waiting. Cosmos, let's get started. Hey, big guy, get in my way and I'll kill you. You needn't worry about me. All I want is Dunbin's sister. I can't wait to see the look on your face when he learns that I'm back and I killed his precious Fiora. Messed up, not a chance. We're going to live through this, and I'm going to see everyone again. Metal face, was it? I think I like you. See, huh? You're not so bad yourself. You were robots meeting, having a meeting, cute, heartwarming. You want to talk friendship? I've got true friends right by my side. For you and I only met for the first time only a couple minutes ago. Come on, we can't let them show us up. Damn. I tell you, the dialogue drags on sometimes, bro. Hey, 
か準備はいい俺の手で切り開く虎の崩しっいつ中華まで近く切り抜け弱電化水晶は三空間飛行機百十字砲覚悟はいいな四角から入り込むエアロート後半息切れしちゃった行くわよ武器が足りないかビンビンバーガー進むしかないもんね燃え尽きろデモンクライドルそこまでマイル確か退屈し魔人で勝負春魔族人烈企画どうしましたし食材を探して行くにゃターゲットイギリのパターン再生クロスインパドこれが速攻タイロー止まりなさいフンピア G ショックやパンモモのパターン再生ノードラゴンツース私を俺が行く容赦はしねえやるしか大変どうしてやらせるかこいつをくらいなそれでどやくらえあげえこいつをくらいなショータイムや本気で行くぜほれほれ見決めるかいなあーしんどこまけゆうおうくらえこの落とし前はつけるうせるなふういつまでと。ただです。剣前ザービス。切り刻む。ズレにしたよ。黙ってみるから。黙ってみる。シメザバ。剣前ザービス。受けしてやる。一か八か。進むしかないもんね。息あり。逃げよ。無駄な時間を過ごした。
俺の手で切り開く。やあ。ベッドで立ち上がり。ドン。ヒモンチョウ。大義を受けてみろ。弱体の水晶。ああ。関空ってそこ。それだと。ハズキ流の名を汚す。ちょっとするよ。ああ、やるか。これも任務。この一撃で打ち倒す。打ち砕くだらんだ。気を覚えて。共鳴。直撃。うん。よ。行くで。こいつで決めてるか遊びはなしだわしも世界に回るんだああ死んだ小牧流王決着だこいつでな俺を本気で怒らせたいよ。大丈夫よ。ゲンマ極。打ち抜く。戦果たばれ。ぶちまけろ。ジェイヤ。ジェイヤ。ジャコが決断。ジェイヤ。ジェイヤ。俺の勝ちだ。言うまでも。力貸せ銃の速さ勝負だ甘く見ないわけ必死もう誰も傷つけさせないこれで終わらせます今こそ扇を受けろ急止したら持ち寄りだぞ小寿司様倒せませんでしたねやってみるわ それぞれの判断でバリュー止まりなさいよっこのアンサーバーは片手ついよ操作しますフリーズショップ発射レイバーモード現時点を持ってサンプリングを終了本当うまくいったわ次も頑張ろうね
Way. Congratulations, Cosmos. You found some quite annoying companions. Chalos, why don't you join us? Do you think I was your friend? That's adorable. No, it looks like I'm going to need more power. How vexing. That she certainly isn't the nicest. Are you going to fight her, Cosmos? I'm sure I will in time. Can't afford to die, not yet. Or should I say, not again? Wait, how did you get here? How can I get back to be honest? We have a mecha on us, please tell me. As if I know. Try to ask the golden chains, all I did was follow them here. I promise you haven't seen the last of me, girl. Not until I bring your head back to, to Dunbun on the stick. Well. I'm not giving up until I get back home, so I'm not giving up until I get back home to them alive, so there. Golden chains, it all comes back to those. Seems there isn't a world out there where they haven't manifested. If we don't do something about them soon, there's no telling what trouble may befall our world. It's over, Marabella. It was that nerves of steel to stay put here. To stay put in there. And I'm just... Miss up all this chaos. Oh, she's oblivious. Good work, everyone. While you were occupied, I did some further market research. My name is now Selfie. Just change your names for marketing purposes. Never mind that. You've got some nerve showing your face after you've been aiding our enemies. I'm very sorry for the inconvenience, sir, but there's nothing I can do after all. The customer's always right. I wonder if, if everyone in the, in the mercantile, mercantile profession is like this. I've been a few merchants and no, they're not all like her. Some are even worse. So if, we're, so if we say we'll do business with you, we can always be right too? Of course, step right in. I even have some prime information you may be interested in. Good deal, all right. Whatever your name is, we'll shop with you. But in exchange, you gotta let us have the information for free. Well, since I haven't seen some of you in a long time very well, this space is highly unstable. Under normal circumstances, it shouldn't even exist. Of that, I'm almost certain. I don't get it. If it shouldn't exist, what are we doing here? We're in a space that was created by someone or something. Is it that right? Created by what? The golden chains, perhaps? Yeah, that weird robo said something like that. Could those chains be why I'm here, too? Likely, yes. There are chains present in Shibuya. When, when Hiryu and Natsu showed up, you all sound like you've been through a lot very well. Here's another juicy 
list or whatever. Here's another juicy info a ten pin sweet free sample laid on this. This space will likely be annihilated shortly. It may be dangerous to be here when it happens. Wait, what? You're telling us that now? Well, what about our vehicle back upstairs? How are we supposed to get that out of here? Cyberspace could be an option. Cyberspace? This is 1994. Can you take us there, Sophie? Well, and listen, lady, don't, you're not, you're doing it for free. You bought that crazy robot chick on us after all. Very well, then I'll make a special exception just this once as a customer loyalty gesture. Haggling is hard work. As long as she gets the job done right, let's get back to the surface and tell the doctor what's up. Alright. For the time being, that's about all I can handle. 